Can you, Adam and Eve? I genuinely can't. That is the biggest win we have had, not just this season, but for a very long time. Palace are back alive. Welcome back to Palace Mad Mason. <laughs> It's Mason here. Welcome back to the channel. I am absolutely chuffed. Every single season, we either relegate someone or dent someone's title hopes. And we've done the latter. Full time at Anfield. Liverpool nil. Crystal Palace won. What I want to know, in a season that I still am quite underwhelmed with, have we won at Old Trafford and Anfield in the same season? How, like, how have we done that? Starting off the game, right, and the lineup, I thought, why the hell is Glasgow chucking Nathaniel Klein in there? Yeah, he came on against City, didn't look very good, but they were they were four one down. Like, of course, City you're gonna go into first gear and make Klein look better than he actually is. But oh my god, every player on that pitch gets a ten out of ten. I want to put it up there as well. Every player, I would do player ratings. Every player, 10 out of 10. So our first win since late February. It's Glasner's second away win of second win of the season. It's our first away win since, since November the 4th. Everything's going in our favour. Brilliant goal from Eze. Brilliant team move. Every player in that back line, whether it was Lerma, Ward at the end, Anderson was my best player in a match. Um, Mitchell's block right at the end. Like, Jesus Christ. One of the best pieces of defending I've ever seen from player in a Palace shirt. I thought Riedeval when he came on was brilliant, but the main man. And it's a player that I've been giving so much uh, doubt in my mind. And I've been giving him a lot of criticism this season. Dean Henderson. That is the best performance you could possibly have done. Like, it was absolutely, he was absolutely brilliant. He saved at least two goals. He was brilliant. And that, I know Johnson is injured for the rest of the season anyway. But if he was still in contention to start, that would put Henderson in the lineup for our next game against West Ham next week. Bear in mind, I've just lost 2 0 at home. I'm going into that expecting a win as well. We are staying up, I think. That game has made us safe. We're now eight points clear again. Um, with, I think we've got six games to go um, with teams below us with a couple of games in hand. But I, I think we'll, we will be fine now. That is a massive win. You can't win away at Old Trafford and Anfield in the same season and not go, and go down. You can't. Like, has it ever happened before? Tell me no. Has it ever happened before? Um, you know, it was brilliant. Mateta played well. Elise, Elise's first start um, for a, for a while. I think his last start was the win at home to Sheffield United back in January under Roy Hodgson. That was his last start, and. He was brilliant. I like the fact that Glasner took him off when he did. The substitutions worked. The players worked their socks off. Hence why he won against a really good side like Liverpool. It was just it was just superb. Like I could not ask for anything more. I do not give credit this season. I'm not really known for it. But I can't help it. Like there's there's not one ounce of criticism I have for any player who was a substitute or started. I don't have any kind of criticism at all. Every player on that pitch, 10 out of 10, absolutely wonderful. It was great to see. It's a really good victory for Crystal Palace. And I, you know what? It's now making me think, why haven't we done this for the rest of the season? We, we've shown what we're capable of. But why haven't we done that for the rest of the season? You know, we've now gone back up to 14th above Brentford, who overtook us in the league yesterday. Eight points clear. I think we're still like nine points behind Fulham. We're up to 33 points. I think that'll be enough. I do. Um, a, a couple of more points will be handy, but I think we're fine now. Full time, 1-0 to Palace. Absolutely superb. Like, share, subscribe. And we're back, baby. We're back. Come on!